Welcome to this video walkthrough about setting up your ePortfolio. So this will be in several parts. The first step is setting up your Google Drive. The next step is setting up your Google site. And then we will talk about how to upload artifacts to Google Drive. And last, we will mention about how to finalize your Google site to submit for approval. So in this video, we are going to tackle step one is setting up your Google, your Google Drive. So we are inside of Google Drive. And all we are is we're inside of drive.google.com is the quick way to get to it. Of course, you can do a Google search. If you type in Google Drive, press enter. Make sure you log in with your Shannon Doe University email address. This is really important because if you log in with your personal and you do this with your personal email, you will have to redo it for your Shenandoah account. So just make sure to double check that over here in the top right hand corner that it says Shenandoah University. So we're inside Google Drive and what we're going to do, our very first step is we're going to create a folder. So we're going to go and press that big new button over on the left hand side underneath of the Google Drive logo. When we press new, we're going to press uh, add a folder and we're going to call this your last name and then ePortfolio and then you press create. So all the folders that we are going to create are going to be inside of this folder. And so before we double click and open it up, we're going to change our share settings. And so what that's going to do is that the share settings we put on this folder will be forced to everything inside of that folder. And so all we're going to do is we're going to right click on our folder name and we're going to press share. And it should bring you up with a screen that looks like this. And so we're not going to worry about sharing it with specific people. But what we're going to do down here where it says get link, it says change link to Shenandoah University. So we want to click on that blue hyperlink. And you can see here, it'll give you some options. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Shenandoah University and I'm going to change it to anyone with a link and I'm going to keep it at viewer. And so what this is going to do is that anytime that you put any of your artifacts inside of your Google Drive ePortfolio folder, it will give the right permission. So anyone out there in the universe can see that. So this Google, um, this ePortfolio is going to be shared with the state of Virginia for your provisional teacher license. And so they don't have access to Shenandoah, but they'll have access because you gave them access right here. And so all we're going to do is make sure our share settings look exactly like it is here on the screen and press the nice little done button. And so we've given those share permissions. So let's go ahead and now double click and open up this folder. And we want to create several folders in here where we're going to upload some artifacts. So I'm going to hit that new button again and press folder. And we're going to call our first one welcome. Hit create. And you can see it pops up here. And this little, there's like a little people icon on it. Means that it took the share settings from what we did in previous step. And now we're just going to go ahead and add a bunch more folders. So we're going to call the next one certification documents. Go ahead and press new and then folder again. We'll, we'll kill this one classroom management. We're going to hit new again in folder and we're going to call this one honors and awards. Hit that new button. You're getting used to it. New and folder. We'll call this uh, human growth and development. And all I'm doing is uh, instead of hitting the dumb button, I'm pressing enter. It's just a keyboard shortcut. Hit the folder again, the plus button with the folder. We're going to call this one lesson plans and practicum. Hit create. Hit that plus button again in a folder. We're going to call this one practicum assignments. And I'm doing great with my spelling today. Hope you are too. Our next folder, we're calling this one technology assignments. And we are set. So we have a bunch of folders in here that we are now going to be able to upload our artifacts. So anytime that somebody wants you to 
upload something that goes to your ePortfolio. You're going to go into your, your last name ePortfolio. You'll double click that folder to open it up and then just hit that plus new button and you can upload, uh, it might be a file, might be a PDF that you have. Um, but you can also create things inside of these folders. But in, an, in, a, in our next videos, uh, we'll show you how to move something into these folders if you've already have made it. So this, that, that uh, finishes up step number one is setting up your folders. In our next video, uh, we're gonna talk about how to set up your Google Sites.